Springs over Kansas that were very pleasant today. However, we are looking for a new front to begin to drift south and eastward. The central and eastern parts of Kansas will very probably be cloudy in the morning, and then western Kansas will begin to get increasing cloudiness by tomorrow afternoon. Today, however, a very, very pleasant reading. 73 up in the Goodland area, 72 at Garden City, 70 reported by Dodge City and Liberal, 72 two, two over at by the good folks of the
each time that you see the frontal system on there, that begins at 6 o'clock in the morning. So you see right the cloud now. pattern move so until happy. 2 o'clock this afternoon. So as of that time, of course, the front is way off in the northwest. Now, however, it's moving into the central part of the nation with a couple of high-pressure set cells behind it. Southerly at about 15 with gusts to 25 miles an hour. Barometric pressure 30.00 and is rising. And no precipitation. We're about a half inch behind. Correction, half inch ahead for the year. And one in 5300s behind for the, for the year so far. We'll be looking for a little bit of a change tomorrow. And, of course, the possibility of some scattered showers. Today, of course, there's nothing showing up on the radar. However, the satellite photo was pretty interesting for the western half of the U.S. Rain showers and thunder showers along that frontal system. And that wide band of fairly heavy snow is now what will happen each time that you see the frontal system on there. That begins at 6 o'clock in the morning, and then you'll see the cloud pattern move until 2 o'clock this afternoon. So as of that time, of course, the front was way off in the northwest. Now, however, it's moving into the central part of the nation with a couple of high-pressure set cells behind it.
progression half inch ahead for the year and one and fifty three hundredths behind for the for the year so far. We'll be looking for a little bit of a change tomorrow and of course the possibility of some scattered showers. Today of course there's nothing showing up on the radar, however the satellite photo was pretty interesting for the western half of the US. Rain showers and thunder showers along that frontal system and that wide band of fairly heavy snow. There's no what will happen each time that you see the frontal system on there at six o'clock in the morning. Central and eastern parts of Kansas will very probably be cloudy in the morning, and then western Kansas will begin to get increasing.